Former Detroit Mayor Kwame Kilpatrick now stands guilty of corruption. He'll await his sentence for corruption in jail. A judge decided that Kilpatrick will wait it out in the slammer instead of at his home just hours after a jury convicted him on 24 charges, including racketeering, conspiracy, bribery, and tax crimes. Kilpatrick faces decades in prison. Today, outside of court, the former city leader had little to say about his conviction. Anything to say to the citizens of Detroit? What do you think it's a lot, a lot of years. Kilpatrick's attorney wanted him to remain free, saying that he's followed all court orders since the trial started back in September. But prosecutors say it's important for public officials who engage in bribery to be held to the harshest punishment possible. But at the end of the day, I think it is the public official who is more culpable than the bribe payer. Certainly the bribe payers should be on notice that uh, when we can make a case against you, we will. But it's the public officials who uh, create that culture of bribery and pay to play, if you will, that is uh, so poisonous to city government. Coming up at 530, we'll take you back to Detroit for the fallout and all of this and show you who else went down with Kilpatrick today.